What's going on Gunners? Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to tell you about my trip I took to the range the other day. I took two firearms with me. I took my Smith & Wesson SD9. I take that to the range with me religiously because that's my home defense firearm right now. And I also took my Glock 17. I don't take my Glock 17 often. Reason being is I'm not accurate with it and I think that's because it is a Glock. Someone was telling me that Glocks shoot low and to the left and that's how my Glock shoots. No matter where I aim, it still shoots low and to the left. Um, at least my Smith & Wesson, when I shoot it, it hits in the vicinity of where I'm aiming. The Glock it just goes low and to the left like I said. So um, I'm going to do a voiceover of each firearm. With my Smith & Wesson, I was trying some new things. I was trying to um, shoot with both eyes open. And then in the first 50 rounds, I was shooting with one eye open. And that's the way I normally shoot, one eye open, one eye closed. Okay, so here I'm shooting with my Smith & Wesson. SD9. Um, everything today I shot at five yards. As you can see, my grouping started to form better. I had maybe two or three flyers, and uh, at this time I was shooting with one eye open, one eye closed. Okay, so here I'm still shooting with the SD9, but I'm shooting with both eyes open. I want to get accustomed to shoot with both eyes open. I believe that's where dry firing at home will come into play and also help me out to shoot with both eyes open better. I was hitting the target, but it wasn't hitting exactly where I was aiming. Um, I was definitely aiming for the red dot on the target, but I was all over the place when I had both eyes open. So there's definitely some practice needed for shooting with both eyes open. Okay, and finally, here I am shooting with my Glock 17. I started off horrible, but as I continued, my groupings got better, but I began to shoot low and to the left. So like I said, I don't know if it's a Glock. Someone just told me that that's the way Glocks shoot, low and to the left, or I'm just not accustomed to actually shooting my Glock yet. Like I said, I've only shot it four to five times since I've had it. So I would definitely take it to the range more often to get used to how it shoots and where it shoots. As you can see, this is where I started shooting low and to the left. My groupings are good, but I was aiming for the red dot in the target. And once again, I was just always low and to the left. I was pleased with my groupings. I mean, I'm only at five yards, but the groupings to me were very good and solid. Um, of course, I had some flyers, you know, I'm not an expert yet, but my groupings were dead on. So you guys let me know if this is true about the Glock that it shoots low and to the left. Okay guys, so that was me at the range. How do you know it was me shooting? You don't, but it's me, believe me. Um, next time I go to the range, 
I do a little bit of better cameraman action so you can see me and the target and my firearm as I'm shooting the target. Um, this was my first time actually taking a camera to the, well, a better camera to the range. Usually when I go to the range, I just take my iPhone or whatever, but this time I took my, my video camera with me. So tell me guys what you think, where do you think I need to improve, um, and any comments that you might have as far as the Glock, any comments you might have as far as me practicing or getting better shooting with both eyes open, leave it in the comments below so we can have some type of discussion going on about that. And one thing I must say about the Glock, I really, really enjoy the trigger. Um, I've had the Glock for about uh, a good year and I've only shot it four times. And the reason why I stopped shooting it was because it just wasn't the it wasn't hitting the targets where I was aiming. So I'm like, it must be this gun. But I'm starting to enjoy the trigger, so I'll probably take it to the range more often to um, become a, a more accurate shooter with it. But if there's anything I can do as far as me shooting low and to the left, you all let me know. Please like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell button and don't forget we're all gunners, whether you're a beginner gunner, intermediate gunner, pro or advanced gunner. We're all gunners. I'll see you guys later.